So I think one of the, the best things about being involved in rugby in any capacity is that um, the, the mental health aspect of being involved in a club, um, speaking to a lot of like-minded people. So just, just taking the whistle and getting into a rugby club is the first step and that's great. Um, for confidence, just go and referee games and just and admit and be open about making mistakes. We will all make mistakes. People will make mistakes in big games, in lower league games. It doesn't really matter because nobody's perfect. But it's, it's acknowledging that and trying to build confidence from just getting the amount of games under your belt. Um, the more games you do, the, the more experience you have and hopefully the, the fewer mistakes you'll then make. Um, but, but definitely that amount of games is, is crucial to anybody wanting to climb the ladder. Having people around you who you can trust so that you don't feel isolated in, the, in those moments is, is probably most important. Um, but you've you got to take some time to think about it and find someone, again, not just having people around you in the moments when you're on the field, but when you know that you feel doubt in your, your confidence levels or um, you're, not, you, you're not sure if, if, if you know you want to referee, but you're not sure how, how you develop, then it's just having people that you trust that you can talk to. And unfortunately, you can only find that by talking to people and just remembering lots of people will want to give you advice, but you, you don't, you have to, you be polite with it, but you don't have to listen to everyone and you find the people that give you the best advice that hopefully can help you come to terms with it and sort of people you can trust to sort of help you along with that. And like I said, it's not, it's not simple, but there's no better feeling than feeling like you've cracked to that, then moments of, of self-doubt. I'd say, uh, I know it's probably cliche, but just get mud, mud on the boots, you know, get the more games you, you can get out there. And the more, it's, it's exactly what I, I tried to experience in terms of doing a schools game on a Wednesday. Will I make mistakes? Of course I will. Um, but it's taking those areas and work on and learnings from that game and trying to bring them into the next game, which is on the weekend. And the more games you can do, the more mud on the boots you can get the better for you in terms of, and you will, you will naturally just build confidence then through the games you're doing because will there always be learnings? Will there always be um, uh, work-ons? Of course there will, but it's about putting them into the next game and just trying to take each game as, as you can and just enjoy the journey.